Oh, hey there, Captain Steve, coming to you day three. Uh, we took the channel going to Lake Okeechobee. Chart said it should be anywhere from six to 13 feet, and we ended up in 1.3 feet of water. And now we're bottomed out, waiting on the boat US to come pull us into deeper water. So, hindsight 2020, and anybody else for future reference, when you get within a foot of your draft, you might want to stop and recalculate and maybe think about turn around and doing another route. We took the upper rim of Lake Okeechobee route because uh, going straight through looked like it was shallow water, but apparently this wasn't the best of calls. But we're not alone. You're not going to be able to see them, but there are gators all over the place. Wait for us to get off the boat, I guess. Right there's one with his head up. There was about two or three more along the shoreline. But all in all, like I said, it's a learning experience. There's one right there. Right behind the boot. There he is. Just waiting, just saying, hey, come feed me. But other than that, it's not a bad view. It's breezy. Like I said, we got Gator Company. So, uh, stay tuned. We should be getting pulled out of here before too long and turn around and go back the way we came and take the other route and be on our way. I'll do another video at the end of day three here. Let you know how we made out and where we got to. So stay tuned and enjoy the gator. Uh, we will. Thanks. Uh, subscribe, like, comment, share, and keep motoring. As long as you're not stuck, sails up, and you keep striving for that bucket list.